It's official. St. Thomas Aquinas College students are heading back to campus on September 8th. And the students couldn't be happier. Mark, how are you feeling about school reopening in the fall? Thank God. Thank <laughs> God. I miss my friends. I miss my professors. I miss it all. So thank God that that's happening again. Mark Keegan, a junior, says those close relationships are what he loves about the college. At Stack, you know, every teacher I've ever had knows me by name. I say hi to them in the hallways. And they're also there to help me like guide me you know they want to see me succeed i am such a neophyte stack is that what the cool kids call the school that, that is the cool kids term stack yeah <laughs> stack so i don't want to look like a rookie when i come you know hang out on campus once everything opens up so what can students and staff expect when the school reopens president-elect ken daly explains some of the protocols there will be masks when they're traveling around campus going to their classes they'll have to have a mask six feet of uh, social distancing, of course, whenever possible. Uh, we're gonna have smaller class sizes. Most of our classes will be offered in person. Each of those classes will also have online or virtual capability. St. Thomas Aquinas will also be opening a new dorm, allowing for fewer students per building. It was going to be the same, and that's most exciting for us, is the quality education that we're known for and the on-campus experience, clubs, sports teams, President-elect Daly, who takes over July 1st, says the college is unique in that it's small, in a beautiful location, Rockland County, and so close to all the boroughs, but it's really the people who drew him to the college. I think that everyone uh, had in common was a real passion and a real commitment to serving students. Even the students are encouraged to help others on campus. It was when I became an ambassador my um, first semester, and I only did one tour, but I was able to, like, you know, share my experience as a freshman with this student who was a senior at the time in high school. And just showing her how like unique our campus was and just how different it was from other schools. And I was just, you know, providing like information that she needed to know, you know, that she didn't know about the school. So I just felt like that was really cool. St. Thomas Aquinas College recruits from 20 states and 20 countries, creating a diverse culture. If you come to our campus, you really will have a campus of many different views and opinions. That's the place where everyone will be respected and their voice will be heard. And when it comes to paying for school, President-elect Daly says financial needs should never be a barrier to education, and he's jumping in to help. And today we're actually announcing a new special scholarship, a $50,000 scholarship over four years for any student or family who's been impacted by COVID from a health standpoint, from an economic standpoint. We really want to ensure that right now when the students need the support most, that we're there for them with a special scholarship fund. So as students get ready to head to campus, what sage wisdom does he have for all? These last three months have been very difficult, starting with the COVID challenges that we've all faced. And then more recently, the tragic uh, instances in our communities around social justice. There's never been a time in our history where quality education is more important. You know, in the future, I want our students to be the solutions. I want them to be the leaders I want them to help us solve some of these problems.